my people my people good morning good morning good morning something on my mind i went on youtube um for a short little bit this morning while i was getting ready and i saw a clip um with lady marian all minister marian all and um she was talking about how in jamaica somebody said that they work for her and she don't know who the person is uh, the case was about a, a dog biting the person and uh, that this person, they wanted her to sell her house at first to pay this person and then they didn't, they changed their mind from the house to wanting her land and she just broke down, you know. And she said she told them to take it because, you know, when you die, nothing is going with you. So all of this is but vanity and I thought about it you know we come into this journey and we work and we work like slaves to get these things and at the end of the day they don't go with us and then we have envious people jealous people we have people bearing false witness against you to get the things that you have and not for a moment they think how is it gonna bless me and benefit me at the end of the day because the, the way you get a thing is important the way you achieve something is very important it determines whether it's kept joyously or not it determines whether god's gonna bless on it or not a lot of times we think we get things from god and god allow things to happen and it's not god it's the enemy now, I don't know anything about this story, but my heart went out to her. Marian, my, my, Minister Marian, my heart goes out to you. But, Minister, let it go, like you said, let it go. Because sometimes God has to make us part with some things to give us better. Yes, to give us better. You don't know what is waiting for you. Dry your tears, Mama. Because you don't live outside on the street and you will never live on the street. You'll never be hungry. You'll never be naked. You understand? And when the enemy meant for you, he will turn it for your good. Dry your tears, Miss Oil. Dry your tears. Better must come. Hallelujah. Dry your tears. Because guess what? The word of God says eyes have not seen and ears have not heard what the lord have in stores for those he loves and listen the bible tell us that they're gonna be trying times trying times not come for us yet it not come yet let them go on let them go on with it let them keep it because they're not gonna prosper it's not gonna benefit them but you on the other hand wait and see because if my people were called by my name would humble themselves and pray and seek my face, then I will hear from heaven and heal their land. That's what the word of God says, Miss Hall. Don't cry over it. Because like you said, nobody own anything on this earth that we're working so hard to pay for. You see the trickery in it? We don't own the land. We don't own the tree. We don't own the water. But we have to pay to live to drink to eat and listen i believe better things are coming he say he will take back what they come it will give you back what the congo worm has stolen yeah man ain't gonna give you a double for your trouble look with job ain't gonna give you a double for your trouble miss marianne don't cry. Don't make nobody see your breakdown. No, and it's not a matter of pride. It's a matter of faith, hope, and confidence in God that he has better things for you. Better for you. He says, he will prepare a table before you in the presence of your enemy and he will anoint your head with oil till your cup run over. And them two angels, surely goodness and mercy, will follow you all the days of your life. And you will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. These things that people are envying, it's nothing but mere vanity. King Solomon said, when you work and toil and get all these things, you just drop dead and somebody has come get it whenever work one day for it. Mm -hmm. So, 
my sister i'm saying this to say this god gonna give you double and triple for your trouble just be still and know be still and know god bless you miss all and have a great and awesome day this sister is praying for you this sister is praying for you boy we woman we cry we do so much and and when they like to attack your christianity like as if christians are not human beings especially jamaicans like christians are not human beings we don't feel we don't hurt we're not just human beings trying to live a life of standard you know but you know what my sister like i said it gonna give you double and triple for your trouble head up queen wear your crown smile don't you frown hey Mm, no don't don't give them that pleasure god bless you my sister and have a great and awesome day bye bye